genius. With one effortless bound, Kermit and the rest of the floppy gang leapt to stardom in the movies. Their latest big screen epic is Muppet Treasure Island, starring Kermit as the salty sea frog Captain Smollett, while the key role of his long-lost girlfriend, Benjamina Gunn, is amply filled by the voluptuous Miss Piggy in the full flight of her fascination. <laughs> like us, the Muppets imitate human beings, but they do it better. They're now back on television with a new show called Muppets Tonight, which will be on our screens later this year. What are they like when they're off screen? Let's get them on screen and ask them as we go by satellite to the Starlight Terrace of the Muppet Complex, New York, and say, can you hear me, Kermit and Miss Piggy? Yes, hello. Hello, Clive. Right here. Kermit, we've just seen a, a clip from uh, Muppet Treasure Island. It's a marvelous film. How do you feel about uh, your role in this film? Well, it was, it was a bit of a stretch for me. You know, I've never done an action film before where I, where I did my own stunts and that sort of thing. Uh, I, got, I had to learn how to, to sword fight. I did that with Tim Curry, who played Long John Silver. Uh, and I think I did a pretty good... Do you think I did a good job? I think you were majestic. Mm -hmm. Majestic. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it's good to hear you being so generous-hearted, uh, Miss Piggy. Can I, can I say that you are a major movie star, shall we say a prima porca assoluta, <laughs> your part in this film is, is, is only a supporting one. Why is that? Well, th there are no small parts, only small actors. That's true. And in Miss Piggy's dressing room, there are no small costumes. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Just a joke. You better right. be. <clears throat> in the movie, you, you, you two play a very steamy love scene. It's a very, very torrid conjunction of amphibian and mammal. How much in acting is involved in this for you two? Oh, it's, it's all acting. None, none of it. No. <laughs> it's all real, all real lust our, and what? passion. Our, our so climb. it's complete our... and total lust. I, 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 passion? <clears throat> gangbusters! Whatever you, you say. You want to know about it. It's so... It's hot! Whatever you say, Piggy. <laughs> Muppet Treasure Island is a family film, and it's, it's promoting healthy values, but a lot of Hollywood films don't. Are, are you worried about violence in the movies? No. No, I, th I think uh, violence can be very appropriate at times. I mean, look at Shakespeare. What would Shakespeare be without violence? Well, well, that's true. And, and uh, but, uh, in our relationship, it has been known that sometimes the frog needs to be taught a lesson. Hang on a second. Wait a minute. Wait there. a second. So but... Shakespeare and the frog and moi have a great deal in common. I think it's best if I just don't answer that question, Clive. Probably. Let me show you. That's right, Clive, let me show you. Wait, now, wait, wait. Now, what see, are you going to do? See, some people think that this is violent. Let me show you. What are, what are you going to do? <laughs> <laughs> well, that, that is not violent. Come here, sweetheart. Come here. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You see where I hit him? I hit him right over here. You hit me right in the stomach. That did not hurt because I hit him right there. Oh, it's the hurt did hurt. Part. It's the fleshy part of the frog. It did. It, it, now, it, it, if I hit him in the throat like this, <laughs> that would really smart. <laughs> Thank you, dear. That was a visual presentation. I think you've shown a lot of compassion there, Miss Piggy. This year, uh, you, I understand you, you're returning to television with Muppets Tonight. Kermit, you're in charge of this. You're, you're the chief executive officer. Is it a high-pressure job? Well, I tell you, you know, I, I'm uh, being cold-blooded. It's very easy for me. I kind of keep my cool all the time. Uh, it works very well for me. Uh, it's good being an amphibian in a job like that. But, but we're very happy with the show. Miss Piggy's been on several times. She's, she's kind of been one of our guest stars. Yes. 
Uh, and and it's, it's going very well, actually. We can't wait for it to, to, to come on over there in London. That'll well, be great. We can't wait for it either. Have we got some new co-stars and feature players to look out for in Muppets tonight? Well... Uh, there, there are some new, new pigs on the show, actually. There, we have one particular one named uh, Spamela Hamderson. Spamela Hamderson. Bimbo! Bimbo, no rocket scientist! Uh, well, uh, she, she's a talented young uh, You get my star. drift, Claus? Yeah, okay. She's very talented. We're not, we're not talking Einstein. Bimbo! <laughs> Bimbo! Skirt! Whatever. Uh, uh, she, she's, a, she's a very attractive young uh, pig. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And, uh -huh. and, uh, and she plays, uh, plays in a sketch we do call Bay of Pigs Watch. One, one, one shot and she's out of here. I, I hear the show has attracted some very, very big human stars. Uh, who's your favorite? Oh, let's see. Well, very we... simple. Two words. Pierce Brosnan. Ah. Well, uh, <laughs> that's true. We, we did have Pierce Brosnan on the show. We're playing the field. Uh -huh. You can keep your football, your hockey. I'm going for Pierce Brosnan. Okay. <clears throat> Michelle Pfeiffer was on. Michelle Pfeiffer was on. She poor, was great. Poor, dear, unattractive lady. Right. Uh, Sandra Bullock was on. Yeah, another, another dog. Cindy <clears throat> uh, Crawford. Oh, disgusting. <clears throat> <clears throat> poor woman. Kevin, you've interviewed more A-list celebrities than I've had TV dinners. Have you got any advice for a, for a less successful talk show host? Well, I hope you're not talking about yourself. I certainly would have taken pointers from you, Clive. But I, but I will say one thing I've oh, definitely... Sure, sure, kiss up to him. No, no, it's true. <laughs> no, no, Clive's been doing this for a long time. I mean, he's a very talented guy. Yeah, very well known, very I respected. Know. That's when he had hair, a long time ago. Uh, anyway, well, uh, anyway, the one thing I've learned over the years, Clive, is you look him right in the eye and you never blink. Right. You never blink. <laughs> That's right, you never blink. Miss Piggy, your, your technical knowledge of the medium is very impressive. Will you be moving on to direction, uh, to directing something? Well, yes, of course, Samoa intends to produce and direct. I am developing various projects. I have a, uh, a rock climbing film, how to, how to Climb Rocks with Heels On. It's a documentary. And uh, I have many... What? Hmm? Oh, I was just checking your heels. Well, don't look behind me when I'm talking to you. I'm sorry. Okay. Is that a very nice thing to do? No, I don't even know. When you must have when you're eyes in the side do, of your do head. I, do I do this? Well, do I do that? Not when anyone's looking. Oh, fine, please. I'm sorry, Clive. What was the question? Well, as superstars, what's your relationship like? Will you stop uh, that? <clears throat> yep. What's your relationship like with the press? Are you persecuted for your fame? No, no, no. no it's a wonderful relationship with the press. Excuse me, Clive. I do believe a frog is whistling next to me. What are you doing? Hmm? Oh, I, I'm sorry. I was just trying not to, uh, not to distract you while you're answering your questions. Oh, whistling isn't distracting. Well, I'll be quiet. You gonna burp next? No, I'll be quiet. Go ahead. Any other bodily functions you want to show us? No, I'm gonna be very quiet. <laughs> I'll just be. I'll you to go. I'll. I'll um, I'm just gonna sit down. Right, you go right ahead. You two have achieved an awful lot for a pig and a frog. And what, what do you think your, your greatest achievement has been? Hmm. Eyelashes. Eyelashes? Yes, my eyelashes. Oh, well, those are pretty amazing. Yes, they, 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 they're, like a, they're like a frame around a picture. My eyes, they're a curse. They're so beautiful. Well, I, think, my achievement. I think for me it's been pretty important to do shows like, you know, Sesame Street. It's good to know that we've had an influence on children, you know, and, and we try to do a lot for the environment, you know, the environment. And uh, you're not interested in this at all, are you? Nope, couldn't care less. Kermit, you've been a top frog now for getting on for 40 years. Is it possible mm. that, 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 that age is beginning to take a certain amount of height off your hop? Well, that's an interesting... Let me answer that. Hmm? No. <laughs> he can hop whenever he wants to. Okay. I'm, I'm getting embarrassed. A frog can hop. Okay. Uh, the truth is, Clive, that, uh, that us frogs, you know, we don't show, show our age all that, all that badly. We have very moist skin. And, uh, and I, do a, I, do, I have a certain workout that I do every morning. Uh, I do some, some exercises, some stretching stuff. Us, please? Well, I can try. Uh, <laughs> you, know, uh, you know, keep the neck limber. <laughs> oh, oh, excuse me. <laughs> I'm sorry. You know? It's slime on me. It, it's, it's a very... It's a it's obviously a very intimate relationship. You two have been together for, for quite a while now. Kermit, don't you think it's about time you made an honest pig of her? Well, I... No, wait, 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 Clive, Clive. Are you insinuating that what needs a frog to define my existence? Are you insinuating that it's possible to make her honest? <laughs> well, that's what you... Remember, it's a throat. 
Miss Piggy and Kermit, wherever you are, somewhere in the river, I think, I, th I think you've proved that it's, it's not just intelligence and talent that counts. What really matters is to be human. Thank you very much, Kermit and Miss Piggy. Oh, thank you, Clive. Is Thanks very it? much. Is that it? I think that's, that's it. That's it. That's it? That's bye it. Bye. I came all the way to this crummy harbor to do this Clive James show, well, that's oh, it? That's all the time they have. I thought it was a two-hour interview. No, 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 it was just I thought a... it was like, like a major deal. No, no, it was just a short 10-minute uh, oh, interview. It. Let's, let's get what? the limo and get out of here. <laughs>